what books or movies influenced you while you were writing Take Your Turn, Teddy? Okay, that's such a great question. Um, honestly, it was several, um, but I think the number one would be It from Stephen King. Um, and I, in my first book, Not Another Sarah Halls, I wrote a note from the author that was essentially an ode to Pennywise. Um, but I carried that into my second novel. And really the idea stemmed from this individualized horror, the reality that, you know, when we watch scary movies, some people will say, oh my gosh, that scene bothered me so much. And other people will be like, I laughed at that scene. Like that didn't bother me at all. And I realized it's not that this person can handle more terror than the other. It's, it's a different kind. You know, even being an identical twin, I'll watch a horror movie with my sister and we'll pick out different parts that scared us the most. And so it is a, is a prime example of that where Pennywise, how he taunts each of, each of the children is very specific to their trauma, to their insecurities. And it just became this huge idea to me that fear is so individualized and stems from you know, our mental health, our trauma, our experiences. And that really became the essence of how I wanted to make Teddy vulnerable to the shadow entity that I created. Mm. Wow. Yeah. And that's, that's so true. And that's, we were talking before we started recording, we were talking a little bit about Stephen King and the different novels that he's put out and how interesting it is, is that, you know, there are some people that hate certain novels that he put out they just can't enjoy them they don't think they're scary but then there will be yeah. other people that say that's the best one or that was the scariest one and yeah. the same thing when you talk about horror movies there are so many different fears that different people have and I, I think that a lot of it is also based on life experience what we've experienced that certain things will hit us on a deeper level certain things will scare us more sure. deeply um, yeah. than, than other things. And so when you start talking about the, the playground that is the horror genre, whether you're a director, whether you're a writer, there is just so much ground to cover. Yeah. Um, and, and that's why I think that when you have a book like It, that covers so much ground, so many different phobias, so many different aspects of fear, also from a child's view and from an adult's view. Yes. It, it hits on so many different levels and that's why people love it because there's something there for everyone. 